Welcome to the 2017 NAIA Women's Golf National Championship. This year's tournament is held in Palm Beach Gardens at the beautiful PJ National Resort. Teams from across North America have assembled to battle it out for the prestigious title of the NAIA National Champions. Before the start of the tournament, we caught up with the favorites for this year's tournament, Kaiser University, who are looking to take their third national championship in a row to see how they are feeling heading into this year's championship. Our team's feeling great. I mean, we got five seniors in the lineup. This is uh, our last week together before they take on the next chapter of life. And um, we're just really trying to enjoy uh, every moment of it out here. And being at PGA National right in our backyard uh, is just going to make it a really special week. And um, we're really looking forward to uh, just playing four, four last rounds together as a group. And then um, you know, these girls have just done a great job over their four years. And we're just looking for a great week to cap it off. I mean, this last tournament is just going to be about enjoying being together. And as you said, we're all seniors, so we're going to graduate. And um, it's quite emotional, but we've said to ourselves that we're just going to try to enjoy it and have fun. And whatever happens out there is going to happen. I, I trust my team, and I know that we'll all do good if we have our, our game like we've had all year. So uh, it's not really about much about performing. Uh, Score-wise, is more having fun and just enjoying our last time together because it's been the best three years of my life and I'm sure that it's been the best four years of their life too here. So, The first round was blessed with beautiful Florida sunshine and all 161 participants were ready to hit the course. The women will be playing the Squire course at PGA National Resort this week. The Squire is a true test of golf with narrow fairways, plenty of dog legs and undulating greens. There are plenty of teams with talent and skill this week to take home the trophy. This year's event promises to be one of the most exciting championships to date. We caught up with the NAIA Assistant Director of Championships to talk about the excitement around hosting the event at such a prestigious venue. Yeah, we're very excited to be here. It's a great setting as, as everyone's found out this week. Um, the girls love the course. It's uh, beautiful weather so far, fingers crossed, but uh, the NAIA is very excited to be here. Uh, Kaiser and the Palm Beach County Sports Commission have done a great job uh, getting everything organized and uh, prepared for a great event this week. So we're, we're excited and looking forward to a great round of competition today and throughout the week. You know, it's a national championship event, so we want to make it a challenge for sure. This is the best of the best in the NAI, so we want to, uh, we want to test them and make sure that um, they're able to accomplish a great deal and achieve at a high level here this week. Uh, obviously, with 161 girls in the field, you want to, you know, find that de delicate balance uh, between challenging them and getting them all through their rounds, especially the first few days. So uh, that was all taken into consideration as we were setting up the course and, and prepping it for this week. So we hope that, the, you know, they'll definitely enjoy themselves, but also be tested and, and uh, show their skills. Spectators from the local community came out to support the ladies in their bid for the championship. The participants were feeling the pressure with a couple of early slip-ups from the favorites heading into this week, but one of the key components to team golf is chemistry, and we caught up with the University of British Columbia team after their round to ask them what they think it will take this week to walk home with the trophy. We're super excited. Yeah, oh yeah. This, yeah, this is my first year on the team, and just to come to such an exciting event on such an amazing facility, it's just a dream come true. We've been working so hard for this, and practicing as much as we can and we're all here we're all ready and we're all just excited to show them what some Canadians can do. <laughs> Every team that's here and has qualified to be here at Nationals has good golf swings and are good at golf. They're very good players but what I think separates us and makes us a fun team to watch is just our energy. We're all so close and we all just want the best for each other and just our chemistry, our energy, we just really pump each other up and we're all just so excited to be here and be here together. And at the end of round one, Oklahoma City University leads by five, with Northwestern Ohio, William Penn University, and Dalton State close behind. Northwestern Ohio and William Penn University will finish their rounds tomorrow morning after a late afternoon rain delay. After some great play today, Courtney Dye and Alicia Smith sit atop of the leaderboard with a host of great players biting at their heels. Make sure to continue to follow the action of the 2017 NAIA Women's Golf National Championship at PJ National Resort and Spa.